Right now at 5.30, imagine spending more than $4,000 on front row tickets to concerts and college football games and not being able to attend the events because you've been victimized by cyber thieves. A local doctor tells the I-Team Ticketmaster still hasn't made his situation right. Yeah, I spoke with that man who tells me after almost three months, he has still been unable to reach a human in Ticketmaster's fraud department. And the list of stolen items is long. They wound up with my front row tickets to see Alana Smorset, my front row tickets to see Jewel and Melissa Etheridge, my front row tickets to see Jason Aldean in Georgia with VIP meet and greets. They wound up with my Alabama tickets, which is coming up on November the 5th. And on top of all that, Jim White, it says cyber thieves purchased Jacksonville Jaguar tickets and tickets to a Nicki Minaj concert after they assessed his sign-in credentials on Ticketmaster's website. White, it says the thefts happened in August, and he still hasn't had a conversation with a Ticketmaster employee. I have called Ticketmaster a hundred times. I stayed on hold three different occasions for over four hours. Now, mind you, every time I talked to someone, they told me, we're going to get back to you. Somebody from the fraud department is going to call you. Instead, White says he's been communicating with Ticketmaster's AI assistant, sharing these frustrating text messages with the News for Jack's I team. Ticketmaster writing, hi, Jim. In order to best assist you, please select one of the options below or click go back for additional topics. Jim writes on October 4th, my account was hacked and all my tickets were stolen. Ticketmaster's fan support replies, in order to best assist you, please select one of the options below or click go back. What else can I help you with? Jim responds, I've been saying this for months and no one is helping me. My account was hacked in your data breach and all my tickets were taken from me. With no response, Jim says he feels violated by the cyber thieves and by Ticketmaster. I think that you need to make this right. I think that I missed out on, on meeting Jewel. I missed out on meeting Jason Aldean. I missed out on sitting front row to Alanis Morissette. I'm going to miss out on front row tickets to Alabama coming up. And you got to do better. You're the largest monopolizing company when it comes to tickets. But you don't treat your customers with the same respect that you want to be treated as the leader in the industry. It's despicable. Now, a spokesperson for Ticketmaster tells News for Jax they are reviewing the incident and will reach out to Mr. Whited. The spokesperson also told me they will keep us, News for Jax, updated on Mr. Whited's resolution. Ticketmaster says passwords were not exposed in the data incident earlier this year, and they added that they are constantly investing money in new security enhancements.